how's it going? Today we're going to go over how to draw a child in a ghost outfit. Basically, it's going to be a trick-or-treater in a ghost outfit. Uh, this is going to be easy and simple. This is for beginners. So we're going to be doing step by step completely for beginners. Okay, so grab a marker, grab a pencil, grab anything and grab some paper. If you don't know what to grab, I put all the stuff I'm using in the description. You can go check that out by that on Amazon. Um, or if you're going to go Amazon shopping anyway, go through that link and then whatever you buy, I get a little bit of a kickback. Uh, Amazon gives me a kickback for no no difference in price for you. Anyways, let's get started on this. Right now, I'm gonna draw kind of a hump shape in the middle. All right, that's gonna be a head. I'm gonna pull a little hump shape on the side. It's gonna be his hand sticking out. Pull a line across here, the cloth kind of coming out there and what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna draw from here his kind of cartoony hand I'm gonna pull out and down I'm gonna start with a thumb shape and then I'm gonna have like a knuckle shape here these knuckle shapes which are just little bumps and they're like cartoony bumps that's it so you have this kind of cartoony ish hand then I'm gonna pull down and that's gonna be the cloth I'm gonna pull this wavy line for the bottom of the cloth. And then I'm going to, I say this, I'm gonna basically pull this up. And you could draw the hand sticking out or you can do what I'm about to do. Just draw like a little bump there. So like somebody's in that outfit, right? So somebody's in that outfit so that bump is there. They're kind of stuck in it. There's no hole in that outfit. Okay, and I'm gonna connect that up. So you have a very simple shape right now. Everything's extremely simple. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna pull down here, pull down here, straight line, straight line, and line across, line across is gonna be his legs sticking out the bottom. Line down here, line down here, out. Bump. It's gonna be one shoe, right? Pull straight down. Still across, I mean. Straight up. And I'm gonna try to imit that, imitate that on that side. Down, across, tiny bump, big bump. And I'm gonna draw a little extra thing because there's kind of like a padding on, on shoes in general. Pull a little extra line there. Alrighty. And then I'm gonna draw the face. And the face is going to be like a ghostish face, so I'm going to draw like long egg-like circle on one side. Right here for the other side. And I'm going to fill that in entirely, actually. Okay. Then I'm going to draw a straight line up here, curve around the side, down. Kind of that shape. Almost like Ghostface, kind of. Ghostface uh, from that movie Scream. And I'm gonna fill that in. You can make any shape mouth you want. You can even make like a smiley face. I think what's really important is the eyes. That's really something to get. And I'm gonna draw his bag. Uh, I'm gonna draw like a bag of candy. So I'm gonna draw a line here, pull down, here. So you got that little like, imagine he's grabbing like, I don't know, a, a piece of tape or something. I don't know, it's hanging out of his hand. Then, Draw a straight line across, and you can make it a simple bag, like a like a treats bag, or you can do this. I'm gonna make a, a curve here, pull across, pull up. I'm gonna make it a hollow, like a jack o' lantern bag. So I'm gonna that back of that eye is gonna be hidden by his cloth. So that's just a triangle another triangle so I'm gonna fill that triangle in fill this triangle in another smaller triangle toward the center all across here Alrighty. and you can draw little lines and I'm gonna try to make it thin right so I'm putting the pressure downward 
So the lines that are like in the crease, that crease across pumpkins, and you don't even have to connect them, you can draw them straight, maybe like dotted lines here. And there you go. You have a trick-or-treater dressed like a ghost. The shoes sticking out, that's the biggest one, and the fact that he's holding that little trick-or-treat bag. I guess a regular ghost could do trick-or-treating. Um, I am gonna put a bit of a thicker line around the contour, which is something that I always do. So I'm gonna throw a little bit of a thicker line around the edges, uh, around the whole thing. So while I'm doing that, let me talk to you about Halloween. I've talked about it before. Um, Halloween is like absolutely my favorite holiday. Um, my one regret is that I feel like I never get into the spirit of it. So what I did differently this year was I started drawing on this channel uh, three times every single day, every weekday. And I started two and a half months out. So I've been doing this for maybe, I don't know, three weeks or so, two weeks. I have to look back, maybe two or three weeks. And I love it so far. It really is putting me in the spirit like nothing else. Uh, definitely, like now, we still got two months, almost. It's literally... Uh, the first, or uh, probably be the second by the time I post this. Um, um, probably the second by the time I post this. Uh, and Halloween's the 31st of October. This is the first of September. So we're way far out. And I love it so far. I'm already feeling it and I'm way far out. So what will make me feel it a lot more is if you share the video because then people come to the channel, populate it, and I have a bunch of cool people talk about Halloween in the comments. What are you gonna do for Halloween? I always ask that, you answer that if you haven't. Um, what are you gonna dress for Halloween? Um, what else do you wanna see on this channel? Um, you know, maybe your history on drawing, any of that thing. And I'm starting to see a lot of the same people comment over and over, and I love that. I love that. So it gets, just gets me more in the mood, like, more in the mood maybe than any Halloween year ever, ever like in my life. So that's, so far it's already starting out great. So thank you so much for anybody that was watching up to this point. Uh, share the video if you can, like I said, like the video, comment, uh, whatever you can is, is, is possible. Thank you so much. And I want you to stay spooky.